In this video, I'm going to show you how you can work with text boxes with VBA. What I have here on sheet two is I have a list of data and I, I have the fictitious company names here. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the top um, the top four companies and I'm going to put text boxes with the information for each of these. So I'm going to go to my, I'm on the developer tab. I'm going to my macros and I'm selecting um, text box and I'm going to run that. And here we have our four, uh, four text boxes with uh, information in them. Now this information is the, the top four lines off the top here and you could reorder these to have different, different uh, values in your text boxes. So let's go back to sheet three. Now these are text boxes. So if you select them, you could move them around without any problem or you can do whatever. And I have another little program. If you don't want these, you want to do something else, what you do to go macro and you go delete text boxes and run and they're gone. So let me show you how I did this. So I have three little programs I've written here. The first one is called text box. And what I'm doing is I create the text box and I give the dimensions of the text box. And I say text box uh, frame characters is nothing. And then, um, then what I do is I select and copy that first text box. And then I place the different, um, the three different versions of or three three additional text boxes on my worksheet in uh, row uh, R8, column 8, uh, column 13, um, and column 18. Now, my next program is I call add text. And so what I'm doing is um, I'm selecting each of my text boxes on the sheet. And then what I'm doing is uh, I've declared the fields of the different rows of what I have in the data. So the company is company, and that's from the first column. Address is the second column. City is the third column. Province is the fourth column. And postal code is the fifth column. And then I say for each of these shapes, so selection shape, uh, text frames, text range, characters, text equals. And then I say company. And this is uh, a carriage, carriage return. And then I go address and a carriage return. And this is the city and the carriage return and province and postal code. And then I go on to the next text box. Now, the third little program that I've written here is called delete text boxes. And so each of the, if you wanted to change it to another version of a uh, different text to go in there, you go sub delete text boxes delete text, uh, each of the text boxes is O text box as text box and sheet three activate and for each of the text box and active text boxes, um, delete next text box. So it just goes through and it does all that. I will of course include the code in the description of my video. Please subscribe.